great crowd here at Agora Gallery. New York is the art centre of the world. It's a great city. Times Square, it's like, what is that? It's like somewhere from the future. Concrete jungle where dreams are made of. You know, these lights will inspire you, I think is another line. And I, I really feel that song now that I'm here. This is my seventh year, and I like working in Agora. Uh, they are very supportive. They're a wonderful team, very professional, warm, and they do a terrific job with my work and advising me. So I keep coming back. My work is about spirituality. Well, I try to bring happiness to the people. That's why it's very strong color. It talks to your soul. I'm so happy to see Francisco at Agora Gallery in Chelsea. After exhibiting his work in 2001 in Soho. And it was a success regarding my career as an artist in Europe. To have a show or part of a group show in New York, it's a big plus. I left New York after 9-11, the market wasn't the same, but now it's all buzzing and I want to be part of it. My work is sort of based on Chinese and Japanese painting. Mo Hua. It's painting with ink. Meditate first and then you just go ahead and, and do them as it comes through you. So I'm very happy. Three have been, three have been sold. I'm very happy. I'm Justine McCullough. I'm a gallery assistant here at Agora Gallery. I'm speaking to you from the reception for our photography exhibition, Illuminations. Um, as you can see, we have so many people here to see this amazing show. Their work is incredible and it spans several different styles and subject matter. It will be open through November 19th. We hope to see you soon. It's a nice opportunity for me to come to New York and show my work and talk about it. I take photographs of signage and graffiti and architectural images that are very graphic and I layer all these things together. I couldn't find it. The these are the mine. Dans la création d'Anne Frank, j'ai rajouté le tissu que portaient les déportés juifs. Ce qui m'intéresse, c'est l'histoire qui rencontre des personnages. 